So this is the way it sets up. Let's go to Jazz and meet him officially. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is brought to you by Everlast Hydrate Elite. We have a couple of fighters scheduled for three rounds at a World Series of Fighting catchweight at 175 pounds. And now, introducing, fighting out of the blue corner, his record is perfect. Two victories, zero defeats, standing six feet tall, weighing 176 pounds, fighting out of Port Orange, Florida. Introducing... And now his opponent on my right across the cage, fighting out of the red corner. He is also undefeated with one victory, standing six feet tall, also weighing 176 pounds, fighting out of Rio de Janeiro, Brazil, presenting Nima Gracie. Your referee is Josh Rutgers. From England. The referee. Judge is ready. Judge is so ready. So we got a, a, Bra Judge we got a Brazilian fighter, a Floridian fighter. Begin. It's an international cast. It's an international affair. Therefore, it is the World Series of fighting as round one is underway. Yeah, notice the world, the word of world. Holy Co, you would imagine, would like to keep this as a stand up. He and the black trunks. And Gracie in his first fight did stand up more than we probably thought he would. Yeah, because before getting the submission. You know, and he, he talked about it in the interview. He says, "Yeah, it's not an impression because everybody right away you, you carry the Gracie name, they automatically expect you to win." You know, if Holy Go wins by knockout, I, I have to say, "Holy Goli, Holy Ko, <laughs> Holy Koli." Watch out with the same kicks. Same as many, 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 many times. Because if an opponent starts timing those, the only thing you have to do is stretch his strong arm, his right arm in this case, and then it could be a knockout. Both guys trying to get their timing down right now. Holy Cole looks pretty comfortable in the pocket. Yeah, and you know he also knows that he can knock people out. He already did. Both fresh though. Holy Cole only one more. Ooh. That's nice, huh? Kind of surprised that uh, Mr. Gracie didn't take that chance, a chance that to see if he could take him down. Once they start throwing big bombs, that's the moment to go for a takedown. Inside kick again by Holico. As he continues to measure his opponent, and Gracie seems content with this at the moment. Yep, oh, he's got to take there. To the left, not too hard though. Just smelt the leather a little bit. Red leather, yellow leather. Red leather, yellow leather. <laughs> nice kick again by Oligo. Basically using his kick like a jab at this time. Gracie just missing with that kick. You can see the power in the legs of Neiman Gracie. Yeah, but you know, he doesn't put his body weight behind it. You know, even if it hits a target, he's got to watch out for the power shots coming back. Halfway through this first round, scheduled for three. Nice. And Holico now is trying with the punches. That is his strength. This fight has been standing up all the way, maybe to the surprise of some, with the Gracie name involved in this fight. Yes, 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 yes. And Holico, he should go. There we already had a fake. But it could be a fake to set up a strike like that. You know, and, uh, but Holico should make his stance a little lower and go also with straight to the body. Don't make your opponent twice about shooting because they think that if I shoot and he just gives me a straight to the body, it might be my head. You get inside their head. Play a little trick. Holy oh. Cole knocks him down with the left, and Gracie is in trouble. Holy Cole has him on the ground and going to town. Holy Cole all over Gracie at the moment. Wow. And Gracie's able to kick him off. Good punching by Dustin Holy Cole. Wow. Nice power, nice timing. Very beautifully done. He needs to get out of this position, though. This is not him. 
And now Gracie's decided he wants to get this to the ground, and if at all nice. possible, he's not going to stand up with Holy Cole any longer if he doesn't have to. Very nice knees also by Holy Cole. Holy Ghost determined that he is dictating the pace, at least here in the first round, and he lets the hometown crowd know. And again with the combination. Same combination, throws over and over again, hoop straight. Oh. And again, nice solid right by Holy Ghost. If he, as soon as he throws the left hook, Gracie should shoot for a takedown. Because you know the right hand's gonna follow. Holico again working hard on Gracie. Gracie rocked already once in this round. It has been all best on Holico. And again, on the button there. And Gracie is staggering and Holico moving in on the fence once again. Gracie trying to hold up and make it through this round with 18 ticks to go. He's to the thighs. I will push away and just keep striking. Time's going to run out in this round, and Gracie is able to hang on. Dustin Holico with a tremendous start. Hits no. and nicely hey, he's timed. Turn Look at this, jaw, jaw, jaw. Area. You gotta face wow. the ring. You gotta face Very the nicely ring. done. Oof. Another one. Man, even Gracie hanging in there though. Uh, he could take a shot. That's the positive thing that he can take from this corner. <laughs> yeah. As you see he's him there with Uncle corners. Henzo. He's got two in the cage. Seconds up, fighters up, let's go. <laughs> Henzo would give a guy a shirt off his back. <laughs> he did. Or, like, or let him wipe his nose on his back. <laughs> he really would. As we just saw, now Neiman comes out for this second Ready? round. Dustin Holico with a strong first round. Let's check in now with Joey Varner. Joey? Thanks, Kenny. I was in the corner of Neiman Gracie. His uncle, legendary trainer, Henzo Gracie, was imploring him to get this fight to the ground. They, <clears throat> they feel that. But Holico... <clears throat> Holico is tired. He's gassed out. They say if he can get this fight to the ground, he can win it. That's what he has to do. And you see it going down. He listened to his uncle, and he's got it exactly right where they wanted him to take it. All right. Thank you, Joey. And that is a great report there because that's the game plan, and that's working now. It's Gracie in control trying to sink in the hand here and see if he can get something working in the guillotine fashion on Dustin Holico. Yeah, the party triangle, everything is on there. Holico knows the defense, though. That's very simple. Just don't let the hands get underneath your jaw. Yeah, Sounds it. so simple. Huh? So after a first round that was on the ground, on the feet, just about the entire way, it goes to the ground quickly here. Henzo <laughs> Gracie in the corner. Yep. And even if you could hear him, you can't understand what he's saying. If the Portuguese-speaking crowd that's tuned in along the web, they would know. Gracie again trying to get to the back, trying to sink in under the chin, and Holy Coast so far showing defense. Yeah, he just keeps his shoulder pushed up and his chin dug in. I will switch my head a little bit to the side. I would like to have my jaw in the middle of my chest. In the middle of my chest, it, it, it's easier for your opponent to get under. Just dig it into your shoulder. Briefly, you got the back of Holy Cove. Bad situation. 
Oh, this he is might another be under bad situation. He might be under here. Let's see if he's got the right arm in enough on Holy Cross. Uh oh, yeah, that's it. He does. He does. He does. He does. And it's Gracie choking out Dustin Holico. Neiman Gracie, after a rocky first round, bounces back with a second round rear naked choke victory. It ain't over till it's over. That is awesome. It is and, over. And for him also, you know, because he, now he knows he can take a punch. He learned a lot from this fight, and then he can still win. So Neiman Gracie goes to 2-0, and oh, and Dustin Holico suffers his first defeat. They got into the ground early in this second round, did Gracie, and then he takes over. And you saw what Gracie was doing there. He was looking at him, and he saw his chin going up, and bloop, lightning fast. And of course, Brazil Jiu-Jitsu black belt, multiple Pan American titles, bronze medalist at the World Championships. Yeah, you don't want to leave the jaw open, the neck open. So two young fighters undefeated. Gracie stays that way. Holy Cove from uh, right here in the Fort Orange area of Daytona Beach suffering his first loss. After a great start, a start where he was able to keep the fight standing up and showed his striking power and his punches and at times looked like he might be able to finish Gracie in the first round. As we heard uh, Joey Varner's report, no way was Henzo Gracie going to allow his nephew to keep it from not going to the ground. Let's get the official time now of this submission and go back to Jazz. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight ends with a tap out due to a rear naked choke at two minutes, 21 seconds of round number two. Your winner and still undefeated, Neiman Gracie. <laughs> Neiman Gracie with the rear naked choke, 221 in round two. Now the final stats today brought to you by Shout. Download the Shout app for free at shouttowin.com. Ah! You were shouting. Yep. They were shouting in the corner at Neiman between rounds. Go to the ground. Go to the ground. Forget the strikes. Holy Co delivering the big strikes, but it didn't work. It was instead when they got it to the ground and Gracie got the submission. And now the highlights presented by Auto Shopper, and here they are. Holy Cove first round, maybe he's got it, but no. You know, that may, maybe mentally it also does something to a fighter. You know, he gives you really hard shots and he just keeps hanging in there. Right away, round number two, boom, there was a take down. Body triangle on, one little mistake, and it is over night night. Holy Cove needs a new mouthpiece. I saw that during the fight already. A professional mouthpiece, please. Which would be? Yeah. Get ready. Uh-huh. Listen. What you want to do? If you don't strike first, that's when they go come at you. Yeah. And you know it's true. Don't let your life get worse. Being timid, that ain't cool. Nah. No.